Hello everyone, welcome to this video. In this one, we are going to complete the task apply tagging via Azure policy. So what we want to do, we want to go back to the policy. So let's go to policy. In here, we're going to go down to authoring then assignments. So here authoring then assignments. And we have assigned one policy in our previous task, right? In the previous task too. So in the list of assignments, right click on the ellipsis icon, require a tag with infra value, which I've done, and delete this assignment. So this assignment, so you just come down here and click on delete. So now we are deleting that assignment. What we want to do next, click on assign policy and specify the scope by clicking the ellipsis. So go back, uh, click on assign policy so where do you need to go now so you need to go uh, here to assign policy and again we're going to click on uh, the scope it's right now it's selected for the whole azure sponsorship and you go down to the subscription so subscription is selected go down to the resource group so over here we are going to go down to the cloud storage resource group Okay, continuing our task, in this one, what we want to do, uh, we have uh, chosen the resource groups to select. Again, if we want to do any exclusion, we could have done that, but we are not doing it here. So for here on step five, to specify the policy definition, click on the ellipsis button and then search. Oh, I think we have already done that maybe, let me see. So here, no, we have not. So over here, we're going to search for the policy. So click, click on this and then it will load a whole bunch of policies. What you can do, you can search by the policy name in here. So over here, you can just search by the name and it will show up and select the policy, hit select. And in this one, uh, configure the remaining basic properties. Okay, this is the basic properties. So the assignment name, we are now going to say inherit the role tag and its infra value. Okay. So basics assignment name, what am I looking at? Assignment name, this is what we're gonna change. And then for the description, we're gonna assign, uh, put a nice description in there, and then hit uh, next. And over here, tag value is role. That's a tag value that we want to have present. And now in this one we'll click and, and on the remediation tab okay we are going to create a remediation tag that's going to be enabled and inherit a tag from the resource group is missing so that's what we are going to do uh, and then policy to remediate is the policy that we already have configured and then this policy is what we're going to do it's going to include the modify effect okay so at this time the rest uh, just go with the default it creates a managed identity and it's going to use that one which has the right permissions so you don't have to worry about it so hit next and then non-compliance we don't have to worry about it hit next and then say create so that is going to create a policy for us now to verify the new policy assignment is in effect you will create another azure storage account in the same resource group without explicitly adding the required tag so last time in the last video we saw that it failed our resource group resource creation so we're going to go back to the resource group where we have this policy that we have just added and this one if we try to create another storage account so let's try that storage account it showed up and uh, hit the create button and again go back to the storage account and then name the storage of something that is unique and then all i need this time uh, i don't have to create any tag i can still create review and create and now the validation is successful uh, let's see what happens actually and then hit create so it's creating the storage account and we have not provided any tags in particular right so once this is done what we'll do we'll go to the tags value of this particular storage account we're deploying and we want to validate if it actually created the tag which we have assigned at a resource group level okay 
If it does, then we know the policy is working fine and we have the governance in place. So the resource deployment is successful. So go to the resource, come down to the tag and look at that role infra. So everything worked beautifully, even though we have not assigned any tags. Any resource that you're going to deploy under the resource group, which is this one, any resource you're going to deploy, they will automatically pick up the tag from the resource group itself, which is role infra, that tag, and attach it to the resources. Okay, so that's all we have in this lab. And at the end, if you want to clean up the resources, let's start with cleaning up the policy. So let's just go to the policy. Okay. And policy, then go down to the assignments again. And the way you delete assignment, we have already shown you. Click on that one and delete that assignment. And hit yes. So that assignment is done. Now on the storage portal, let's get rid of the storage account as well. So you can just uh, taste storage account and then hit delete. And uh, just say the storage account name, you got to copy and paste in there. So copy and paste and set delete. So it will delete all the stuff that is in there. In the list of storage account, enter the resource corresponding to the storage account. So if you need to delete the tags even, so we'll go down to the, to the storage account go to the tags and then I'm just gonna set delete all so that will delete all the tags that we have created so no no tags now in the list of storage accounts we have already done that in the portal again search for storage account use the menu to select the storage account so let's just do that one last time go there create click on the storage account there's only one left right now in the list of storage accounts select the storage account that we created in the last task so we have already done that so we are all done so in this series of labs, what we have done in the first lab, in the first task, we learn how to create the tag from the portal. In the next one, we learn how to enforce a policy to make sure that anytime you're deploying, you gotta have a tag. And in this video, we learn how to create a policy that will take the tag from the resource group and automatically attach to all the resources. All right, thank you uh, for watching the video. Let's meet in the next video where we're gonna start some more administration work in your Azure portal. Thank you.